In this video, I will show you how to do a handset change on your laser master from am.co.za. The first thing you need to consider is where you want to do the torch change. The place you choose needs to be clean, dry and free of dust. When it comes to welding, you got your welding handset. Two sets of wire feeding tubes, wire feeding wheels and welding nozzles. We need to change power cables here. We need to change air and water tubes here. We need to change the fiber cables on the handset. We change the two cables here. Change the clear pipe for the air. And the two white pipes for the water cooler. On the handset, we change the fiber cable by twisting the locking screw and pull the fiber cable out. We insert the fiber cable into the new handset. You need to align the slots to push in all the way and lock with the locking screw. Roll the cable from the old handset and pack it away safely, not to be damaged. Now pack all the cables together and close the sleeving. With the wire feeder, we got two sets of tubing for 1 mm to 1.6 mm and 0.8 mm to 1 mm wire. The nozzle is for the wire feeding tube. The wire feeder wheels also come in assorted sizes from 0.8 mm to 1.6 mm. The different nozzles are for different welding angles. Take your selected wire feeding tube to the wire feeder, open wire feeder, we already got 1.6 mm wire installed. The feeding wheel size required need to be installed facing to the inside. And secure with lock screw.
Now, screw the nozzle to the one end of the feeding tube. Push the tube with the nozzle from the outside up to the wheel and lock with the screw in place. Now, use the attachment supplied and screw it to the other end of the feeding tube. You then attach it to the torch and secure with the screw. Clip the feeding tube in the holder. Make sure you fit the correct nozzle for the required wire thickness. Now you switch the machine back on and we're ready to feed the wire through the feeding tube. Now insert the wire through the intake over the feeding wheels through the nozzle then lock the feeding wheels with the locking mechanism press the feeding button on the feeder until the wire comes out on the other end by the handset. And that is it for the handset change. Thank you for watching this video. Remember, you can always call our technicians for assistance. marks the 10th anniversary of am.co.za in the South African market. And through that time, we have experienced considerable growth and expansion with the support of our valued customers. To mark our 10th anniversary, we have bought a warehouse at Sunny Rock in East Grand, and we will commence with renovation and construction in 2023. The facility will comprise a massive 2,000 square meter warehouse, 300 square meters of demonstration space, 150 square meters of sales space, and 400 square meters of spare part storage on the top floor. 550 square meters of showroom space on the middle floor. 400 square meters for machine.africa for machine repairs with its own dedicated entrance. And a 250 square meter tea garden and coffee shop for your convenience. Our group now comprises four businesses. AM.co.za is our main business and supplies the machines, spare parts, and consumables. Machine.Africa does the installations for our clients and handles on-site and factory repairs. Ambitious Academy ensures that our clients achieve the very best levels of productivity by providing training and certification. And our automated AI-driven online store, Buy This, brings all products online and distributes countrywide. We invite you to be part of this exciting journey as we establish our new headquarters. Watch as the process unfolds and be part of the adventure to meet all of your machinery and productivity needs with this magnificent new facility. am.co.za. Achievement matters.